heading up into the Arica Alps. I'm going to bag Ben Narnane today, which is up that way. And then tomorrow I'm going to bag the Cobbler and the Ben Aim. And head over the mountains over to Inverar. Here we are, the start of um, Ben Narnane and also the start of the route to the Cobbler but on this occasion I'm going to do Ben Narnane and hopefully I can do it in about four hours <sighs> I don't think much of this path As you can see, it's an easy going walk. The sort of walk you could take your grandparents on a lovely sunny day like today. Oh, it's so jolly. Looking back down, I'm going to have some fine views of Loch Long. Loch Long at Arica. The Arica Alps. Easy walking backwards you can. Okay, it's so simple, even Heather could do it. Oh, you got to love a rocky scramble. You can't beat it, like, you can't beat it. Even though it's near the morning. Another view as I continue to get higher and closer to Ben Arnane. Views over Arica and Loch Long. Well, that's me back down from Ben Narnain. I was heading for the Bothy, but it's going to take too long, so I think I've found a little cave here. So I think I'm just going to spend the night here in this little cave. Have a quiet one.
Now you see why it's called Loch Long. Oh. So I'm almost at the top. There's um, Ben Lomond in the background. We have Loch Lomond just in front of from in front of Ben Lomond. And then we've got Loch Long and Arica. And we continue almost at the top. I think. Approaching Ben Narnane as the cobbler comes into view on the left. A grand place to stop for lunch. Have you brought your lunch? Still approaching Ben Nurnain. I thought I was getting closer, but it turned out I wasn't quite as close as I thought. Very quiet up here today. Not, a, not another soul in sight. Probably because I started walking about one o'clock, so most people tend to start early. I think. I tend to start late. Almost there. Oh, no, we're not. Well, we're almost there. A little bit further. Uh, I think we're almost at the top now. Just about there. Should be seeing the checkpoint just very soon. That I see in the distance, sight for sore eyes. Oh, that's what I've been looking for. Finally at the top. in three hours. Approximately three hours. back down again. Hell, that was fun. Well, that's it. Time to head back down. And it turned out to be a lovely night. As we descend from Bernardine back down to Arica for a camp out by Loch
So um, <coughs> no better way to end the night than some beers and a wee fire. No tunes tonight though. I think there's a there's a guy packed up in the car park. He's like oh, logs um, log bloody. So I think he's sleeping. So I better not bother with the music tonight. I don't think. But cheers anyway. Nice and dry, Attica. Cheers. Oh, well, that's um, Friday morning waking up by Loch Long. And it's been a dry night for a change and I've seen no rain in 24 hours which is an even better sign. I think it's supposed to stay dry until tomorrow. So I was hoping it stays like that and just having a quick coffee before I make my way up Benheim in the Ardacar Alps. And that's me ready to head off, just packing up and then I'm heading up back up into the mountains and to do Benheim and the cobbler. <laughs> <laughs>